it's Dorothy and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today we're in a different kind of setup because I am testing out some DIYs and I did this video before and I loved it so much that I decided to do it again. So everyone who's been on Pinterest knows that there's pointless DIYs out there and I decided to gather them all up and do them for you guys or test them out. So yeah, let's see how this goes, but before we get into it, this is a huge collab with a bunch of my favorite people on YouTube. All their pictures will be on the screen, like always, and their links will be down below in the description box. They're all doing some DIY, so make sure to go check them out after you're done watching my video. And yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. I live my day as if it was the last Live my day as if there was no past Doing it Okay guys, so now on to the first DIY Here's a picture of what it's supposed to look like And let's see if I can recreate it So I have my cotton balls My mason jar filled with one third water And then some paints and glitter The first step says is to mix the paint and water Ah! <laughs> Okay, that works. Now I'm taking my blue paint, and now I'm just taking some pink paint. And now I am going to take the lid, and I'm supposed to shake it. That makes a cool sound, though. Okay, it's basically just purple. And so the next step is to fill this mason jar with cotton balls, and you're supposed to stick them in there with, like, a butter knife or, like, a stick, but I don't have either of those, so I'm just kind of putting them in there and hoping for the best. Um, this basically explains every situation in my life, honestly. I filled up the mason jar a little bit more and I'm going to add some more paint, or so it says. So let's see if I... Whoa, that made such a weird noise. Now I'm just sticking some cotton balls into the thing. This honestly, I don't think this is coming out to what the picture looked like, but like, where's the pink? Where's the pink supposed to be? I'm so confused. Okay, so now the mason jar is mostly filled up and we're gonna add some blue paint. It still looks purple. I'm probably doing all of this wrong. And we're gonna stick them in there. Well, um, this is the final result. It looks okay. Doesn't really look like the picture at all. I can kind of see the pink. Don't see the blue. I probably did this wrong. I'm not gonna be keeping this in my room, but if you guys wanna try it out and tell me what I'm doing wrong, let me know because I obviously need help. And now we're here with our second DIY. It's supposed to be puffy paint, so I'll put a picture of what it's supposed to look like over here, and I'm gonna try to recreate it. So all you need is some shaving cream, glue, and then food coloring. So it didn't really tell me how much I'm supposed to mix together. So we're just kind of winging it, but what's new? Okay, so I'm just putting in some shaving cream. Oh God, okay, well. Yep, that's cool. So the mixture obviously isn't that appealing, um, but I'm gonna mix it around. And now I'm just gonna take some red food dye and just put it on here. Okay, so now we have this puffy kind of paint mixture and I'm gonna try to draw a picture. I'm gonna draw the YouTube sign. Okay, well I'm not a good painter in the first place, but this is kind of weird. Like it's not coming out how the picture. Ooh, wait, wait, here we go. Okay, it's not, it's a weird like, I don't know. It's really weird. And I like this DIY so much that I decided to do it again, but this time with blue food dye. And I just made some shapes, and then when it dried, I got to poke at it, and it was really fun. So I'd recommend you guys do this DIY, and if you do, make sure to send me pictures. So for this DIY, we needed borax. But I didn't have borax, so my mom said this was kind of like borax. And then we're using some glue. It's supposed to be non-washable, but the only kind of glue I have is washable. So we're already off to a bad start. I'm just going to take this bowl and I'm going to pour in some glue. And it says to have an equal amount of glue and water, so I'm going to pour glue and water into this mixture. Okay, so I just put some water in and now I'm just going to stir it up a little bit. The next step is to take a teaspoon of this. Well, it's supposed to be borax, but let's just pretend it's borax. I'm just gonna put it in there and we're gonna mix it with the same thing because I'm running out of spoons here. Wow. <laughs> this is just a representation of my life. Honestly, there's so much going on right now, um, but it's supposed to dissolve in the water. So we're just gonna wait till that happens. Okay. 
Okay, so it's not fully stirred, but it's taking too long to do that, so it's mostly dissolved. Let's see if I can do this. And now I'm supposed to mix this until it gets to a like jelly-like substance, so let's see how this goes. Okay, so it's not working, so I'm gonna add some more glue, because glue's always good, right? Okay, so I'm pretty sure this substance is not supposed to be this liquidy. So this DIY failed out of the most, like, it's the most failed. I'm kind of upset about it, actually. I wanted to play with the silly putty. Congratulations, you've made it to the fourth DIY. I barely have. It's been a struggle. I haven't gotten any of these right. But we're here to make a lava lamp, and this seems pretty cool. So the first thing I need to do is mix my oil, my vegetable oil, with some water. So let's do that right now. So the next step is to pour the vegetable oil in. This is so cool because the oil always goes to the top of the water. Now that the vegetable oil has kind of settled down, I'm going to take five drops of this blue dye. Whoa, guys, that's so cool. Now I'm taking some Alter sensors, and I'm just gonna put it in to make the whole thing work. <gasps> Guys, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. Ah, I love it. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so cool. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you did enjoy. Also, comment down below which of these DIYs was your favorite. Honestly, this I'm mind blown. I am so proud of. Like, oh, it's so cool. And these other two, I mean, just A for effort. Right, guys? Right? Don't forget to check out all of my friends' channels. Their links will be down in the description below. And before you guys go, make sure to subscribe to my vlog channel. I'm going to be posting everyday vlogs of my trip to the Virgin Islands. And as this video is posted, I am in the Virgin Islands. So make sure to go check it out and see what I'm up to. And more videos are to come, especially vacation videos and all that fun stuff. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next Sunday. Wow, I did not think this through, okay? Hold on, I'm coming, I'm coming.